Welcome back to my garage. With the machine all set up and ready, the next step is to tell the machine what to do. But first, I want to go over some high-level terminology. The first is CAD. CAD stands for Computer Aided Design. Software like Fusion 360 and Mastercam allow you to design a part in 3D space. The next term is CAM, Computer Aided Manufacturing. This is when you create the toolpaths, telling the machine what to do. You can also use Fusion 360 and Mastercam to create the toolpaths. There's so much great information online to learn CAD and CAM. I highly recommend John Saunders' videos at NYC CNC and Titan Gilroy's videos at Titans of CNC. Both of these places have been pivotal in my journey as a machinist. John and Titan both have a passion for teaching, and their videos are easy to follow along. Be sure to check them out. There's a third term I want to go over, conversational. Pathpilot allows you to design the tool paths for simple parts and shapes right at the machine. We'll learn more about this in a later video. Now let's go over the workflow for when you have a part you want to make. Step one is design the part in your design software. This is the CAD portion. I use Fusion 360. Step two is to create the tool paths, the CAM. This is where you'll select specific tools and the operations they perform. Step three is to set up your workpiece and tooling, just like we've done in previous lessons. Step four is to run your program. The final step is quality control. This is where you measure to verify the part is the size you intended it to be. This can be done with calipers or a micrometer. Okay, we'll leave it there for now. In our next and final lesson, we'll finally get to run a part.